Hello, my dear friends. You are welcome once again to the Voice of Hope. Once again, if this is your first time in joining us here on this station, we are here every day, Monday to Friday, same time for the Word of God. If you are watching on YouTube right now, then please click the subscribe button and also click the bell icon and you will be notified anytime that we post a message and God will bless you. Don't forget also to tell somebody so that together we can prepare ourselves for the soon coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Today is day number four in our special series on how to live a stress-free life. Today's message has been entitled, Be Still. Simply that. Dear friends, if you want to live without stress, the first thing that God has told us is that we must trust in Him. The second thing that He told us was to delight in Him. The third thing was that we must commit everything to Him. And today He says, Be still. Be calm. Wait patiently on me. It is funny because these days, remaining patient or be, being still is something difficult. Because we live in a fast-paced world. From fast internet to even fast food, we want everything to be done quickly. That's why sometimes when we go down on our knees to pray, we want our prayers to be answered quickly. Everything we want must be done quick. We don't want delays. That is why it has become very difficult for a lot of Christians to wait on God. And if you are not able to remain calm, if you are not able to remain still to wait on God, you are going to be stressed all the time. Psalm 37 verses 7, the first part, says that be still in the presence of the Lord and wait patiently for Him to act. Be still in God's presence. Learn to wait on God. Don't rush in life. Whatever you're looking for, remain calm and wait on God to act. If you're looking for a job, remain calm. Avoid shortcuts. Don't be pressured by the fact that other people have been working for so many years. People you started with are making it in life and you are still where you are. Don't follow them. Be patient. As you seek for a job, be patient and wait on the Lord to act. Is it about marriage? Don't rush, my dear sister. Wait on the Lord to act. Is it about your, your finances? Don't go about boring or necessary to end up in huge debt. Wait on the Lord to act. Whatever you want to do, if you want to live without stress, then learn to be still. Learn to be still in the face of hard situations. Learn to be still even in the midst of storm. Remember when Jesus Christ was traveling with his disciples in the boat? Hope you remember that. The Bible says that they came face to face with a fearsome storm. The disciples did not learn from Jesus. They started trying to solve the problem on their own. And what happened? They became fearful and stressed out. But in the midst of that storm, Christ was sleeping. Why? Because Christ had learned how to remain calm in the presence of the Lord, even in the midst of a storm. My dear brother, my dear sister, be still, okay? Don't look at the fact that sinners are making it in life. Don't let that one bother you. But be calm and wait on the Lord. Yes, other people you started with are far, far ahead. Be calm and wait on the Lord. Because God has time for every one of his children. And when your time is up, not even the devil and his angels can stop what God has destined for your life. So today, keep working hard. Keep doing everything you have to do. Don't be lazy. Do everything you have to do. But avoid shortcuts. Avoid shady schemes. Avoid things that are against the word of God. And learn to be still and wait for God to act in your behalf. Father, thank you so much. Bless all those who are waiting on you today. Prosper them and grant that they will continue to wait on you. And as they wait, Father, cause them to soar higher with the wings of eagle. In Jesus Christ's name, amen. God bless you and have a blessed day. Shalom.